O'Brien. Come in, O'Brien. I know you were in this ship. Drifter? I didn't think I'd ever hear from you again. The radio's been dead. Turn it off. Look, I need your help. I'm listening. My wife. The woman you helped me track down. I remember. I found her, O'Brien. She's alive. That's incredible. The odds of her making it out. No, look, I don't have time. Look, I found her. She's alive. She's being held by uh, the militia. The guys that you told me about. I'm sorry. Okay, look, I don't need your goddamn sympathy. I need your help. She's being held in a place I can't get to her. I need you to help me to break her out. You know I can't do that. Wait a second. Okay, but there's something you have to do for us first. You name it, I will do anything. Keep your radio on this time. I'll be in touch. Okay, O'Brien. O'Brien? Oh, damn it. St. John, you there? Weaver, yeah. I can barely hear you, though. You're breaking up. It's this damn cave. I'm surprised this didn't get out at all. Hey, I'm an MP3 player. Okay, yeah. where's that? I was at a refugee camp at a community college when it got overrun. Community College? Uh, the one east of here off Highway 97? Yeah, that's the one. The one with the fighting platypus or some shit. Yo, anyway, when I bugged out, I left everything behind, including my tunes. Oh, shit, I gotta go. Radio me when you get there. Weaver out. Uh, sure, Weaver, whatever you say. Drifter, are you there? Oh, Brian! Okay, where the hell have you been? Meet me at the coordinates I've just transmitted. O'Brien out. O'Brien. O'Brien. Oh, Jesus, he's... Damn it. Weaver, I'm here. Say, John. All right, man. Hey, I was housed in some kind of tent. It was like right in the middle of camp. Okay. Uh, can you tell me anything else? I mean, come on. These all kind of look the same. All right, well, I'll have a look. St. John out. Corporal St. John, this is Colonel Garrett. Report. Yes, sir. Corporal, good, yes. Another traitor was discovered in our midst. Okay, this pretty much looks like a marsh. Let's go look. Just a few more. I gotta find more. Oh, God damn it! She was right. Criers. Oh, damn defected crows. Never gonna leave me alone if I don't burn out their nests. <sighs> that should do it. St. John, this is Colonel Garrett. Report. Yes, sir. Corporal, good, yes. Another traitor was discovered in our midst. A spy working for the anarchists. Anarchists? Yes, you're 
remember. Escape before he could be. He was chased north, but our patrol lost him. He blocked the position he was last seen on the map. We need him alive, Corporal. We need to find out what he was doing here, and what he knows, and what his group wants. Yes, sir. I'll do my best. As do we all. As do we all. Dismissed. Another bounty. Ah, I need fuel. This is Ricky to Lost Lake. Come back. Yeah, Ricky, what's up? Ricky? Boozer! Can you hear me? Dick in a Lost Lake camp. Come back. Just, uh, checking in to see what else Addie needed. She... God damn it, Ricky, I don't know. Oh, Iron Mike said... Booze man! Ricky! Well, give him hell, Booze man. Give him hell. Mike's grab. Okay. My dead grandma can run faster than that. Coming! Stop! One, two, one, two, one, two, all take! A short while ago, 
I stood here before you and grieved for the loss of Captain Jimenez, our only doctor and my very dear friend. And for what great purpose did Captain Jimenez perish? So that a drug addict, a worthless excuse of a human being, could get high. Jimenez died because he stood between a junkie and a bag full of narcotics. Yeah. yeah. I have taken steps to see that this never happens again. For their own safety, I have moved Lieutenants Whitaker and Weaver into the Ark, where they will be under protective watch 24 hours a day. The call is going out. Any person who has highly trained knowledge and skills, skills that cannot be replaced, Mechanics, engineers, scientists, medical personnel are to be taken from active duty and removed to the Ark until this war is over. From now on, no one is allowed entrance into the Ark unless they are on special assignment and unless they are personally vetted by myself. There will be no exceptions. I am beginning to see, I'm afraid that our enemy has never been the freaks. They know not what they do. Mankind, in all his state of degradation and transgression, is our true enemy. Keep a watchful eye on your neighbors. Evil surrounds us. Company dismissed. Well, would you like to taste it? Go right ahead. Thank you, Corporal. I hope you were careful. This is very toxic. Yeah. Yeah, sure thing, ma'am. Uh, listen, I got a plan. I don't have time to explain, but the next time I get here, get ready to get the hell out of here, okay? Corporal. I didn't thank you this time. As you were. <laughs> 